There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world Hey, it's your girl A. What's up, everybody? What's up, Divas? What's up, Divo? It's your girl A. So, normally I don't do these type of videos, but I figured, you know what? This Christmas, I had like a blast with the grandkids. I had a blast with my own kids, and they got me some really good stuff this year. So, I said, what better way to show it off is with a Christmas, what I get for Christmas haul, y'all. But first, I want to just let y'all know, this video is being sponsored by Dossier Perfume, where you can get amazing, inspired replica scents at only $29 a month. So, ladies, I have showed you guys this in a recent video, and I absolutely love the scents. They do smell dead smack on. I will link the one that I did previously in a few months ago with Dossier. But let me tell you guys, if you don't want to spend a lot of money on smell goods, definitely you want to check out Dossier. They have everything you can imagine. They've been around for some time. And if you don't like the scent, you can easily send it back or return or an easy exchange or your money back. So this month, I did get three of my favorite inspired scents. One of them, which I wanted to try out really bad because I love this one particular like smell good person. Okay, this one particular designer so let's start off with this one let's tell you on the outside what your pick is which is this one is floral violet and it comes with a stock card which tells you about your perfume and where it's been inspired from this one is floral violet and it is inspired by mark jacobs daisy so i do have the actual authentic mark jacobs daisy but i did want to do a smell comparison to that so that is the reason why i did get this one which is the floral violet and we're going to do that taste not the taste test because girl i'm about to be tasting the perfume because then you y'all already know i'm crazy but girl i ain't that crazy but we are going to be sent testing the different perfumes. So this one right here is going to be Floral Violet and it's a inspired scent by Marc Jacobs Daisy. So each one of them do come in this perfect size bottle. You get plenty of perfume in this and it has like a magnetic top which goes right on. Nice size bottle, very chic. Plus this is the Marc Jacobs Daisy. This is an original. My daughter Tati gifted this to me just as a Mother's Day gift. I'm going to spray the Marc Jacobs on this hand or this arm. Girl, I got a little bit of ashiness going on, okay? Because I've been doing hair videos today. So the wig that I have on in this video is by Wow African. And if I remember, I'll definitely link it below. But girl, yes, beautiful, beautiful hair. Okay, so now we got that. We're going to try out the Floral Violet, which is the Inspired Scent by Marc Jacobs Daisy. And we're going to put it on this arm right here. Okay, let's go for it. This is the original Marc Jacobs. And this is Floral Violet. Floral Violet inspired by Marc Jacobs. So on a threshold to me, on a threshold of one to 10, I'm going to say this is more like an eight. Now, the only reason why I'm saying that is Marc Jacobs is definitely a stronger scent. It has a, a stronger scent to this. This is the intense. So that is the reason why the scent is so strong. And the reason why I gave it an eight is this one is more potent. You can really, really smell it. While this one right here, you can definitely smell it, but it's not as strong as the Marc Jacobs Daisy, which is the intense one. So there are different versions of each perfume. Um, I do notice some type, sometimes they're toilet, which is a lighter scent. So this one right here is the intense. But on a scale of one to ten, I'ma say I'ma give it an eight. I'ma definitely give it an eight. It has a fresh scent. It has a very nice light scent. Sometimes you don't want something overpowering. With the Marc Jacobs one, it gives me a very strong, intense scent. And I know this would be something that if you wash it and you're washing your clothes, the scent is definitely gonna stay in. So still smells good, still gives you that same vibe, just not as potent as the original Marc Jacobs, which is an intense scent. So right here we have Amber Cedarwood. And there's one thing that I did want to mention that they also do cater to men men's cologne and also unisex as well now this one here is amber cedar wood and i think this is one that i wanted to try so bad and this is inspired by yes okay guess what, what? this is inspired by theory mugler which is one of my favorite designer perfumes i love terry mugler and i hope i'm pronouncing the name right so this one is inspired by their alien scent and i do have one of the other ones that i first started off with let me tell you terry mugler or theory mugler or however you pronounce it their perfume is so strong and potent even the first one that i received as a gift for my daughter is super duper strong if i remember the name of the first one i'll definitely post it in the video but i still have it it smells so good it's very strong it's one of those perfumes that if you spray it 
on yourself or on your clothes when you wash your clothes the scent is going to stick so it just so happens that i actually got the original um original terry mugler alien for christmas so let me just you know i was going to show y'all that when i did my little christmas haul but i guess i'm gonna just i'm gonna show it to y'all twice okay so this is alien by terry mugler and i absolutely love this perfume this also is intense as well the actual bottle itself is just absolutely gorgeous just gorgeous so i'm gonna take this one and i'm gonna spray the original on the inner portion of my wrist And then I'm going to take the amber cedar wood and I'm going to spray that on the right side of my inner wrist. This do smell like it though. So let's give the scent test to this one, which I already know it smells so good. Like I really feel like this perfume could be like a unisex perfume. It smells so good. Mm. Okay, so you know what? I'm going to give them a 10 out of 10. The only reason why... I'm giving him a 10 out of 10 is for one i feel like any perfume by mugler is like a hard perfume to replicate because the, strong, the scent is so strong and you have like all these different scents and it feels like or smells like it's just wrapped in one but the scent is just like everlasting it just has like this everlasting scent like i said you wash your clothes and you can still smell the perfume now with the dossier one amber cedarwood it has the same exact scent and it does smell pretty damn strong too. So this one is like a dead smack on 10 out of 10. The strength is there with this one. The scent is there with this one. This is a definite, definite inspired scent by Terry Mugler. I do, I do appreciate this. So, you know, if you want a budget or you just want to try different scents and you really don't care about the brands, but you just want to have the scent, definitely check out those here. I'm going to definitely give them a 10 out of 10 for Alien because that was dead smack on. And now I feel like I got perfume on my lips. Now this one is amber sage okay i do believe that this is one that i don't have as the original we're gonna see iconic sense designer quality no mark this one yes i definitely don't have this inspired scent, so i cannot give you a comparison to it but this one here and you can see the color is like a yellowish color and this is inspired by tom's board fucking fabulous eau de parfum this is the reason the only reason why i wanted to get this one right here which is ambery sage only because it was inspired by tom ford and because of what he called it fucking fabulous fucking fabulous can't remember if this is a male or female or unisex perfume i really feel like it's a unisex one i will list everything down below for you guys so here we go and i have not smelled this one i've had this box for like a month or so this smells good it smells damn good i really feel like a man and a woman could wear this yeah this smells effing good this smells fucking fabulous yes now i would really 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 like to compare it to the real deal so you know um valentine's day is coming up you guys and if y'all have no valentine's well <laughs> neither do i girl you, you thinking about me you like oh girl april need a valentine's day gift you know i don't really care who's sending man female whoever okay you feel like you want to give me a valentine's day gift then go ahead and give me the original time for is fucking fabulous it ain't even got to be no big bottle you can get the smallest bottle they got i know the love it comes from the heart i'm just saying just putting it out there but yes you guys check out dossier they have plenty of scents to choose from if you're looking for something for your man for valentine looking for your lady or whoever something for valentine's day we'll just hook them up with some of these nice smelling scents i'll link everything down below for dossier so now girl we're gonna get into my christmas haul y'all okay. you know what this christmas was really great for me you know all my kids was here you know we had like an amazing time my daughter tati dressed dressed up as the Grinch and scared the hell out of the kids, the grandkids, and I thought it was a blast. I thought it was funny as can be. Girl, my side. Sorry about that, y'all. My daughter, Tati, was calling me. She's giving me some sushi right now because, girl, I love sushi. Whew, and I'm out of shape, too. Had to run downstairs real quick, check on my dinner because I'm making some curry chicken for dinner, girl. Yes, a girl can cook, okay? Let me catch my breath, girl. So as I was saying, we had, like, a really good time for Christmas, you know. I love to see my kids together. I love to have all the grandkids together. When Tati came out with the Grinch, you know, of course, the kids wasn't expecting it. They didn't know, so it was, like, funny, and I just had a blast laughing at them you know what i'm saying like because they terrorize me all year round so one little day out the year ain't gonna hurt nobody but it was great family fun so like i was saying i never did any christmas haul before so this is the first time for me my kids were just amazing to me always you know what i'm saying i'm so glad that they appreciate me because i appreciate them too but they really did give me some nice christmas gifts this year and so i'm really really happy about it so i'm about to show y'all real quick so this right here is my new favorite cup this is a 40 ounce mumsy got me this for christmas i love good cold water that's all i put in these is water 
I keep it by my bedside at night. I sip on it. I feel like this is the easiest and the best way for me to drink water is when I have it in one of these cups. It keeps it cold for 38 hours or something like that. And it keeps it warm for like 12. So I don't really put anything hot in it at all. I just use these for water and I absolutely love them. It did come with this little bear straw protector on the top of it and it's spill proof. So yes, I love this. I love it. I love it. So now I have two. Okay. Tati got me this. Girl, listen. She got me a coach fanny pack. Now this is an authentic coach fanny pack and she got it from the coach outlet online. This is definitely FUPA approved girl, okay? This is the one thing that I'm loving about this fanny pack. Plus it's big enough I can fit my coach wallet in it which also comes with, I do believe this is a change purse on the side. However, I do remove it because I don't really care for it hitting me on the side but it has a pocket in the front right here that you can just slip whatever in and then this part is really nice and deep so yeah, you see I've been putting my stuff in there already. I got my gum up in here and then it has a little slot inside. Buckle is really 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 heavy and this this buckle girl if you if you was to swing this at somebody and hit them upside their head it would definitely hurt then it has like the belt straps on the side so girl yes i'm loving this plus she just ordered me the matching wallet to go with it so it'll be here tomorrow but i love this the reason why i got this fanny pack y'all already know i showed y'all and i told y'all my last video you can't go wrong with a fanny pack okay girl fupa approved fanny pack y'all know i was telling y'all once you wear a fanny pack you can never go back okay so tati thought she would spruce it up for me a little bit if you're gonna wear a fanny pack you might as well just do both go go hard right there are some things about me that you really don't no, and I'm I like to color. I'm a big colorer. So at night when I'm smoking my weed, I do sit in my bed and I and I color. So for Christmas, I did get some coloring books. Love a good marker. Like don't go to the Dollar Tree store. That is not gonna work for me. I need like some really good markers. I do have my favorite. So anyway, yes, I do like to color. Mumsy got me this one, which is like a little pocket size one. I'm gonna just show you something real quick that I done up in here, so that way y'all know that I be serious about my coloring. I take it serious. I can color. But damn, okay, look at that one. Okay, this one. Okay, it relaxes your mind important thing to do when you are coloring with markers especially on a certain type of paper you want to make sure you have like a nice piece of oak tag or something underneath each sheet so that way it doesn't bleed through because as you see on the back it does bleed through so got this one that Nay got me for Christmas which I didn't color like six pages but when I tell you I be coloring I be coloring I just don't color with cheap markers I, I just can't you know the marker is what makes the coloring okay yes I don't like just any kind of coloring books like stuff like this okay it's stuff like this this is black woman curvy black woman I love coloring books like this right here anytime type of thick girl coloring book also type of home decor coloring books i also love those too like this one right here which mumsy also got me and it just gives you like different decor and things like that very particular about what i color now another thing y'all probably don't know about me is I like to read comic books like i've been the comic book reader all my life since i've been a little kid but i also do love the walking dead series so i've never had a walking dead comic book so tati blessed me this christmas with all four volumes of the walking dead i did not know i did not know that a comic book could be so thick and big look how thick this is okay this is the walking dead volume one um complete volume one compendium one is what they call it i think that's how you pronounce it this is an entire comic book number two i'm a big huge walking dead fan number three okay there we go we got negan and then the fourth one which we got princess and you know the star troopers this is the fourth one so you love the walking dead and you love comic books then just check it out amazon they are always available and this was one of the gifts as well that tati gave me so girl, i had to bring this upstairs out of my kitchen i should have just took a picture is an ice maker it's a nice portable one i want an ice maker for so long so this this one right here is what Tati got me and it makes ice within 6 to 13 minutes. Easy to use. I don't like anything too complicated. If I can find it. I'll definitely link it below. It makes nice little ice cube like bullet. Really cute. Really, really nice ice cube. So Tati also made me a gift basket. She put some really nice stuff in it. It has become one of my favorite lotions. The EOS Shea Butter 24 Hour Body Moisture. This is the Jasmine Peach. Smells so good and it's really good thick lotion. The Vanilla Cashmere. She also put in here for me Dub Sugar Cookie Body Wash. I love Dub. Dub smells really Really, really good. I got some Hershey Kisses candies in here. She made everybody a basket. Me, Mumsy, Nay, and my daughter-in-law, Sharina. We all had a basket with some lotions and some smell goods in it. I got these socks in mine. Everybody got a nice pair of socks, and these are really cozy and soft. I also got the Alien Perfume, which was also in my gift basket, which I already showed you guys, but I'm gonna show it to you again, okay? She also put in a Bath & Body Works candle, which is my favorite, which is Fresh Balsam, and she also did buy me eight other Bath & Body Works candles. And um, my daughter, Nay, she got me a Bath & Body Works gift card. Today, I did tell myself I was going to go to Bath & Body Works because the three-way candles was $10.95 for two days only. That was today and yesterday. And I forgot all about it. Oh my God. I like to go to the Bath & Body Works outlet. If you go to the outlet, you can find them for like $8. This will go a long way when you go to the outlet, but I never get tired of getting Bath & Body Works candles about all I really do like from their, uh, their store. Tati I mean, also got me for Christmas, Crocs for Christmas, and I'm a huge gibbet fan, so my Crocs be decked out with gibbet. These are the all-terrain sandals, and I really do like these. These are really really comfortable now these are the size 10 plastic crocs this color 
which is like a tealish color blue of some of these pink ones so me and my granddaughter could match with each other because she has two so she also got me so those for my daughter nay i ended up getting a pair she got me a pair of cowgirl boots they are so cute in detail these are size 12 only because some shoes they don't take into consideration that your foot cannot fit all the way at the tip i want it to be safe and it does have a little bit of room in it which is great because if i could wear a thicker sock they fit comfortable they go like right up to my calves i really really like them and i cannot wait to wear them i'm gonna have to pick me up a nice looking cowboy Tati also got me these eyelashes these are my favorite eyelashes that I get from Amazon. They're all natural hairs. They have a clear band and they're just super easy to put on. They look very natural. I really don't want like my eyelashes too big. You always get a little free gift with them. You'll get some Q-tips and then you'll also get some hair ties. Also a little set of wispy demis to go with your lashes. One pair of lashes, they last a long time. They hold up really well. So this is the brand they're called Fry Happy. My daughter-in-law and son gave me a new robe for Christmas. Really nice. It's like the soft, blankety like material. It's nice and lengthy. Has pockets. Kind of like cheetah print type of design going on. Right. So Nay bought me these for Christmas also. This is my favorite brand of markers. They, they're like the mid-price, really good markers. This is a set of 48 fine tip um, marker pens. And there's another tray underneath. So this is the brand of markers that I really do use a lot. I have like really good markers. But now for Mumsy, because Mumsy do have a job, y'all. Y'all probably like Mumsy. Yes, Mumsy got a job. Okay, she done bought me the cup. She bought me some color books. She has a job. She watches my granddaughter for Tati. Because Tati works night. So she watches her when she leaves for work. She probably sometimes leaves at 6, 6.30, whatever. Mumsy makes sure she's fed. She bathed her. She put her down to bed. So Mumsy do get a paycheck, okay? She get paid every two weeks. Mumsy did buy me some markers too. Now, like I said, I love Arteza brand, but I also do like Uhuhu markers. They are bomb ass markers too. So she did get me some of these and I'm going to show you the colors. They're double sided. So each marker right here is what she bought me. And these are like a really good brand too. And then up here are some more Arteza markers, which I also love like the same brand. These are all Arteza markers right here. And also I'm going to take the phone. I'm going to show you what else I got. So that way we can hurry up and end this video, girl. Okay. So hold on. Okay, so this car this little caddy cart right here is what Tati bought me for Christmas to store some of my markers in. So my basket will go back down there. These are just like my other markers. These are all Arteza markers on the top. On the bottom are my coloring books. So see, I have a lot of coloring books and some more markers in here, which are also by Arteza. And then I'm gonna show you guys the last thing that Tati got me for Christmas. And then we're gonna end this video, girl, because I'm making curry chicken, okay? So yes, like I said, if you love our, if you love a good marker, you definitely wanna check out the Arteza brand. They have amazing markers. Let's go downstairs and I'm gonna show you the last bit hey, of my So this is what Tati also bought me for Christmas is this nutcracker. He is over six feet tall and she got him at Sam's Club. He's very heavy. So I made a little plaque for him so that way, you know, he could be sturdy and I put a little, like this is Tinky's picture and I just wrapped it up and made it look like it was a gift. So yeah, she bought me this for Christmas as well. And she also bought me, she also got me the doorbell by Blink. So you guys, and this is my house for Christmas. Here goes my buddy. All right, you guys, so I hope you enjoyed this Christmas haul. This was the first one I've ever done, and it was kind of fun. But y'all know I'm about to see y'all on the next one. I love you all. Stay diva and delicious. Stay safe, stay blessed. Happy New Year to you all. It's 2024, so I hope you all have, like, an amazing year. Love you all. Stay diva and delicious.